Lindy here from Horror Tree back again with another dose of my Horror Tree weekly wrap up. And today, as usual, I'll be talking about four submission calls that are currently up on the Horror Tree website. And hopefully one of the calls I talk about today gets your creative brain going. We need to get amongst that and get amongst it you shall. <laughs> so let's get started. Okay, first up is Eric Publishing and these guys are seeking lost books and authors. So it's recently come to the attention of the guys at Eric Publishing that several small and medium publishers have decided to close their doors, leaving the their, 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 um, authors that they once published out in the cold. They want to try and support you guys. They want to try and support you lost authors if they can. So I strongly suggest, and they strongly suggest as well, that you jump on their website, jump on the Horror Tree website, check out the submission call, jump on their website as well to make sure you have the full details of exactly what they are looking for because these are their words, not mine. Please do not send them a query without having read all of their guidelines as this makes them grumpy and unlikely to respond in a favorable manner. Get on the website and get all the information you need. And if you do have a book that you've recently lost a publisher for, I really do hope these guys can help you out. Okay, next up is Beagle North and their Halloween competition. So they want your spookiest horror short stories. Anything goes from your classic ghost stories to vampires, werewolves, or to something a little stranger. This means the overall genre can be non-horror, but there must be something in there that is spooky and gives them a scare. It can be a monster story. It can be a killer on the loose, someone or something unnatural or somewhere haunted. It's up to you. If it keeps people up at night, it counts. Okay, they're up after short stories of up to two and a half thousand words. Now, the prize payment, prize payment for this competition is first place, 20 pounds. Second place, 10 pounds. Third place, 10 pounds. And the top 15 to 20 stories will be published in their Halloween anthology coming in October, 2023. And the submissions close on the 31st of August. Okay, next up is Three Ravens Publishing, Heathens and Heroes. So the theme for this is, are you a fan of authors like Robert E. Howard or Michael Moorcock? Are those the type of stories that you love to write? then you are in the right place. They are looking for tales of sword and sorcery slash heroic fantasy that are influenced by those who established the genre. What makes a great story in this genre, you ask? Well, elements of romance, magic, supernatural, and of course, sword-wielding heroes engaged in exciting and violent adventures. They're looking for new, previously unpublished stories that take them on an adventure and leave them wanting more. So they're after of they're after stories of up to of between, sorry, they're after stories of between 5,000 to 10,000 words. Payment, stories selected for publication in the upcoming anthology slash anthologies will receive a percentage of the sales divided equally between the contributing authors. And the submissions close on the 1st of November. Last, certainly not least, is Inked Publishing Hidden Villains Betrayed. So the theme for this is Hidden Villains Betrayed and they are after bold, imaginative fantasy, horror and science fiction sculpted to thrill and entertain readers with a bizarre or delve into the shadows finish it off with a twist of betrayal. There is no restriction as to how you incorporate the theme into your story as long as you as long as the genre falls within the speculative fiction including science fiction or fantasy. There are after stories of between 2000 to 8000 words, one submission per author, no reprints, no simultaneous submissions and no AI. No AI. Um payment is zero two cents per word plus a royalty share from all draft to digital sales a paperback author's copy will be provided for us authors authors outside of the us will receive at least a digital copy depending on shipping costs on a case-by-case -case basis so the submissions for this open on the 1st of june and close on the 31st of august and that's it guys another 
fantastic week, a fantastic submission course by fantastic publishers. So hopefully there's something there that has grabbed you and you want to get creating and get submitting. So if you are going to submit to any of these submission calls, all the very best of luck to you as always. And all the information you need as always is up on the Horror Tree website. Get on there, check it out. It has everything you need. Do it, you won't regret it. And as always, if you are watching these videos, we thank you so much. We really do appreciate it. And if you could hit like, hit share, hit subscribe, hit comment, leave us some feedback. We would love to hear from you. And as always, thank you for watching. You are all rock stars. Okay. And until next time, guys, thank you. Stay safe, stay cool, and stay spooky. See you later.